Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome to HDTV, where we're going to bring you the latest updates and news. I'm Nolan. And I'm not Liz. And here's a word involving Herf Jones. Hello, hot dogs. My name is Mark Hudson with the Herf Jones Company. Herf Jones is the official supplier to Frankfurt High School for class rings and graduation products. We have scheduled a class ring order day here at Frankfurt High School on Wednesday, March the 6th, during the lunch periods in the Commons area. Class rings are a symbol of your school, your class year date, and the memories you create during your high school years. There are many styles, stone colors, and activity designs for you to create a truly unique class ring just for you. Please stop by the main office to pick up a class ring information packet that will help you design your class ring and give you more information about the options and prices. If you want to order a class ring, please bring an $80 deposit to school on Wednesday, March 6th during your lunch period and we will help you order your class ring. You can also have many of your questions answered by visiting our website at herfjones.com. Thank you, hot dogs, and I look forward to seeing you on March the 6th. For lunch today, on lines 1 and 2, we'll be having cheese crunchers. On line 3, soup and salad bar with chicken and rice soup. On line 4, potato bar. And on line 5, Big Daddy's Pizza. And a happy birthday goes out to Haley Campbell, Isaac Nickham, and Chloe King. And now to, my, and now to sports with my man, Nick. Thanks. Last night, the boys' varsity basketball team hosted West Lafayette in sectional action. The dogs were ultimately defeated by a score of 67 to 41. Coach Van Dyne has scheduled a meeting after school tomorrow for all boys who participated in basketball this year, including the freshman, JV, and varsity teams. At the meeting, you are expected to turn in your equipment and any of and, and any end of the year items. Official practices for softball will begin on Monday, March 4th. Any girl wanting to play softball must be at practices beginning March 4th. Practices will run from 3.15 to 5.30, Monday through Friday. Be prepared with clothing for colder outside practices and clothing for indoor practices if needed. Physicals must be on file with the athletic office prior to that time. There will be a mandatory parent slash player meeting following practice on Monday in the Ox Gym at 5.30. All players must be present for the meeting along with the parent. That's all the sports news I've got for you today. Now we're to Liz and Nolan with more hot dog news. Thanks, Nick. If you have any overdue books from trimester one or two, please return them to the bookstore this week. Also, Ellis Jewelry is having a design contest. If you're interested in designing your own jewelry for a prize, then enter before the deadline, which is April 1st. All seniors, the Deputy Prosecuting Attorney Special Victims Unit Victims Advocate Team will be here Thursday, March 14th to better prepare us all in scenarios we may face within our lives. It will be from in the auditorium from 10 to 10.39 a.m. So try to be there on that day so you can attend. All right, guys, that's it for the news today. Make sure to like and subscribe and tune in for more tomorrow. I forgot what...